Hello and welcome to my latest eBay auction for this Miele S831 bag cylinder vacuum cleaner. It's hardly been used, it's in almost brand new condition as you'll be able to see from the video and from the pictures I've uploaded on the listing. So it's barely been used as I say and I've upgraded it with a active charcoal filter and you get extra bags with this that you wouldn't normally get. So I'll just take you through the machine as you can see. It's a standard sort of Miele vacuum cleaner, very high quality, uh, quiet and powerful. The machine is at the moment in its, what Miele call its parked position. So we've got the standard floor head here actually parked on the back of the cleaner. This is useful if you need to pause cleaning, if you need to answer the door or do whatever you need to do, paint your nails, shave your legs, whatever. You know, as you're vacuuming, if you decide that you've got too much stubble on your legs and you need to get rid of them, then just park the machine and pop it there. I'm not being sexist, I'm referring to men as well. If uh, you chaps like to shave your legs or other unmentionable parts, then, you know, you can just pause and lift the machine up and get cleaning. While we're down here, here is the standard floor head you get with this machine with a setting for carpets and hard floors. You just move this pedal with your foot to lower the brush down the hard floors. So a brush comes down at the front and at the back you've got this squeegee strip that helps to trap any dirt, stops it from um, the suction missing the dirt. When it's in carpet mode, let's flick the brush back up. You've got a nice metal sole plate, so the sole plate glides easily over the carpet. And you've got these two large red litter pickers either side of the suction inlet. And they help to deal with more difficult litter such as pet hairs, uh, threads and fibres. It's also got side suction channels so it cleans right up to the edge. It's fitted with Miele's click fitting system. So we've got a button here to release the tool. You just squeeze the button and it just comes off easily. There's no tugging and then when you want to put the nozzle back on put it on, turn it until you hear a click and then that's locked securely in place. Also we have here a telescopic extension tube so there's a button here so you can adjust the height of the tube so you can compact it down for storage or adjust it right up high. It does go quite far so if you're a tall person you shouldn't be stooping and bending and because it gets to a nice length you can reach up high to deal with those cobwebs. Got a comfortable curved handle, there's a suction regulator here so you can briefly reduce suction if you're cleaning delicate uh, rugs, lightweight rugs or delicate fabrics. So that's the tube and hose and of course you get um, a very long crush proof hose that Miele say you could drive your car over and it will still bounce back to its normal shape. Here's the cleaner itself, finished in a, a nice royal blue, it's very smart looking. First thing to show you is the tools that are stored inside. You just press this button here and the lid springs up and inside we have three further cleaning tools. We have a standard Miele upholstery nozzle, that's good for your upholstery, your stairs, your curtains and that's got uh, thread pickers either side as well to help deal with more difficult litter and pet hairs. Here we have a crevice tool, ideal for cleaning in tight spaces in your car, down the side of your chairs, uh, around the edges of your carpet, just all those nooks and crannies. And that fits back in, which way does it go? There we go. And then finally, we've got a little dusting brush here, that's good for doing your pelmets, your blinds, shelving and it has an adjustable hinge so you can, well not a hinge but it's adjustable anyway so you can, it's multi-angled so you can twist and turn it according to what you're cleaning and all three tools, let's just turn that back how it should go all the three small tools store neatly inside so they're kept safe and they're there for when you need them. Here also, just on the bag door, we have a little indicator that shows orange 
when you need to replace the bag. Further down we can see we've got the control panel. We've got a foot operated on off switch, a foot operated automatic cord rewind and in the middle here is your variable speed control so you can go from a minimum 300 watts for your delicate items like lightweight curtains right up to 1800 watts full power for doing your hard floors. There's also this setting here which is the silent setting which um, provides you the optimum performance but with a lower noise level and of course lower energy consumption. I'll just switch it on and go through the various speeds for you. Even on its full power, it's not a noisy vacuum cleaner. It's hard to gauge the noise from a video, but compared to many vacuum cleaners, this doesn't make a lot of noise at all. Right, inside, because this is a bagged cleaner, if you have allergies, bagged really is the best way to go because it keeps all the dirt very hygienically inside this bag. These are the latest bags, the high clean bags from Miele. This uh, model takes the FJM bag, so when you need to buy new bags, you just need to look for a red collar, there we go, which corresponds with the red bag holder here or just ask for FJM bags. Like I say, you'll be getting a brand new bag in the machine and also supply a couple of spare bags which you don't normally get. Another upgrade I've made to this machine is I fitted a new Miele Active Air Clean filter, which is here. This replaces the standard air clean filter and this, if you listen, that noise you can hear is activated charcoal. So the idea behind this, it prevents smells from entering your room. So especially if you have pets and the dust bag starts to smell a bit, the activated charcoal inside the filter helps the filter out the smells. And of course there is an electro electrostatic layer which filters out very fine dust. But I also provide, which came with the machine, this grill here. So if you want to use the standard air clean filters, which normally come in a pack of bags, if you buy Miele bags, you can downgrade to use that. This should last about a year of regular use. And if you use the air clean filters, you can replace them every time you buy a new box of bags. That fits in nicely and securely there. That's it and it just locks in place. It's a very good seal. It's a sealed system. There's also a motor filter here in the dust bag compartment as an additional protection for the motor. And then the bag simply slots in here until you hear a click. And then that's it. Make sure the bag's tucked in. You're not trapping it anywhere. And then you just close the unit down like that. So that's the Miele S831. I'll show you some other bits and pieces on it. It's got three swivel casters, smooth running swivel casters, very well made and it enables you to manoeuvre the machine back, forward, side to side. It really is easy to follow you around your cleaning. You don't need any fancy balls, just three swivel casters will give you all the manoeuvrability you need and if you do bang it into your furniture there's a furniture guard that goes right round the machine this would be the area here that you tend to bang into the edges of the skirting boards but it's a nice soft material so it protect the cleaner and protect your furniture from damage well the last thing to show you well two things to show you before I finish as well as the parking bracket, you get on the side here a storage bracket. So you can actually attach the handle, sorry, the tube, and get it in. There we go, whoops. Attach the tube into there. And that makes, uh, makes it more compact for storage. And it's also when you carry the machine, it just keeps everything together. Final thing I'll show you is the automatic cord rewind, so I'll just pause the video and unplug the cleaner.
Right, so I've unplugged the cleaner, get a nice length of flex for this so you can reach around your home without having to unplug too often. Plus of course you've got the length of the hose and the tube. To rewind the flex, just press this pedal either with your hand or your foot. And the flex goes neatly in there, let's turn that round. And even the plug, that says a nice little home for it there. So there we have it, that's the Miele S381 bagged cylinder vacuum cleaner. If you'd like to own this lovely Miele that's practically brand new, please place a bid. There's no buy it now price I'm afraid, but there's no reserve either. If you're the winning bidder and you live local to Halifax in West Yorkshire, you may pay cash on collection. If you don't live locally, it will be sent in its original box with the spare bags and full instructions and it will be sent via a secure courier and you should receive it within two to three days of receiving payment. If you have any further questions regarding this vacuum cleaner, please click on the link in the listing.